All right, Justin here at the Kruger Training Academy. We're testing the reduced pressure principal backflow assembly. Um, we're gonna start with our differential to confirm that we have a differential. Then we're gonna check our relief valve opening point. Then we're gonna do a back pressure test. Then we're gonna take our static differential for check one. I like to think of it as like a little story. We go up a hill, we close the shutoff, we come down the hill, we mix, then we do B core, and then we're only two steps away. And that's how I remember it in my head. Uh, so when I say, well, first we gotta notify, identify, inspect, and observe. We're gonna do a running flush. We start with four, three, two, one, to, con to make sure that we preserve the reduction in pressure as the water flows through the assembly so that the relief valve doesn't open before we're ready to record it. We're gonna hook up our high in front of the check and our low behind the check. They're on two and three. Now, when I say go up the hill, that's because that helps me remember that we start with the low and go to the high, low to high. So we open low. Well, I'll confirm these are closed. Right, everything's closed. We open low, bleed low. Now we go up, we open high, bleed high. At the top of the hill, we close the shutoff. Now we gotta come down. So we go from the high to the low. We confirm that we have a apparent differential pressure above five and that our relief valve is dry. That lets us know that we can proceed with the test. So we're gonna do the mix. To mix, we open the high control one full turn to let the high pressure into the manifold. We crack the low. I'm gonna go very slow with this and only confer, uh, make sure that I get you know a few arrows going so I'm not reducing the differential too fast. Mix these together and record when the relief valve opens. So we just give a little crack and we check. We don't have too many there. Now I'm gonna watch this and when it comes, I'll push the button. There we go. So our relief valve opened at 3.3. This low control is only open while we're using it. So we're gonna close that now that we're done using it. And we're gonna do our B core. This stands for bleed, connect, open, reset. Very important to get all those steps and to get them in the right order. Uh, I don't like to say bleed for too many things because there's bleed tees and all kinds of things to bleed. Uh, so some people like P-Core, Purge, Connect, Open, Reset. But we got there and now, like I said, we're only two steps away. It's gonna be here and here. This, we're gonna put pressure in here to see if our check two is working. We know that if we put pressure in the number three test cock, that it's gonna make the relief valve open. If we put pressure in the number four test cock, is it gonna make the relief valve open? Let's see, we got this open still. This one's closed. We open our bypass. So now we're pushing high pressure into test cock four. The fact that the differential pressure didn't drop to the relief valve opening point lets us know that check valve two is working. So water's not passing backwards through the number two check to get into the zone. Um, so now we can confirm that that's working. But it now did drop a couple. It did drop. That's because of the disc compression. Uh, when we put high pressure onto the back of check two, it pushed check two and reduced the volume of the zone. When you reduce the volume, the pressure goes up. So that's why we're getting, you know, uh, kind of an artificially low reading here. Like I said, we're two steps away. We open that to confirm check valve two was, was working. To get our static differential for check valve two, static meaning not moving, because we know the water's not moving because the check valve two is closed, all we do is reset the gauge. And now we get our static differential for check valve one. So our static differential for check valve one is 7.4. Check valve two is closed tight and the relief valve opens at 3.3. Cool, that's the, that's a wrap. Right? So I think I got it.